Shalom Cardinals, I hope that you are doing well. Thanks for joining for your next set of readings. This is going to run from the 24th, 25th, and 26th. And so if you're returning, welcome back. And if you're brand new, my name is Shannon, and I'm glad to have you. And listen, my channel looks at a lot of criminal-like activity. Um, you know, obviously every reading's not going to be for everybody. So, you know, just take the pieces that are resonating. I'll try to be as general as possible with the reading. But uh, my work on my channel is a heavy work to get rid of nasty, filthy behaviors. And... We are in a time in history where judgment is occurring on, you know, the whole world. If you just look around, look at the world today. Uh, things are happening because how people play. And it's not okay. And it's time to stick our finger in this crap and get rid of it. And some people are, are in some type of a dangerous mode. And so you just need to stay calm. Whatever's going down, the, the, I mean, the energy flow for me on the day that I'm recording this, it's been huge. It's been real huge huge energy and I've seen player cards several different times today and it's just huge energy and uh, some people are trying to get away with some stuff and they just they won't if you're standing the truth and you are connected with the the great and holy one uh, you know people call him the universe or the divine he's everything he's got many different names but I call him by a scriptural name because the scripture is found in the tarot the living language is here you will get scripture on my channel uh, I am not ashamed of Jehovah Elohim, maker of heaven and earth. He is Yeshua. His son came and walked among us and uh, uh, in the flesh and died and rose again. And he's, he's everything to me. And so he's just mighty on this channel. And he's just called me to do this type of work in, in this fashion. Um, to, to go right even down in the, in the most hardest places where some people probably wouldn't uh, 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 you know, felt that Jehovah would show up for them uh, to teach uprightness, you know. And so uh, I, I just, whoever finds these videos and wherever people are, it's it's to show what's going on in the heart. Jehovah is a, a revealer of the heart and the intentions there. And so you've got to be willing to look in your heart to change something. So my, my channel is a very spiritual channel. For uprightness and Jehovah will speak things that are right and he will tell you things before they happen and he'll make your crooked place straight for you and give you hope and uh, so anyway I keep all ten of the commandments all ten of them and uh, so within that um, you know we're protected okay the law of love is on my heart but I'm not afraid to get up and war for love because Jehovah is also an Elohim of war he teaches our hands how to war against his wicked people who try to steal from you and kill and to take your things and that ain't no okay. Okay. And you'll is judging now. So this is what my channel is about. If you stay, you stay. If you don't, okay. Um, thanks for checking me out. All right, let's get started. All right. I think I did something here with my card deck. Jehovah, just come on in here. Sweet Holy Spirit, I just uh, invite your presence here. Jehovah, rebuke and bind and block every foul, wicked, dark energy. Show me energy, please, for Cardinal Libra, um, Capricorn, Cancer, and Aries for the 24th, 25th, or 26th. What's going on with this energy, please, Jehovah? So this Queen of Cups, this, okay, she's, she's here this week. Whoever this person is to you, and it's, if it's Cancer, it's a Cancer. If it's a Pisces or Scorpio, it is. It could be somebody else. Just, you know, everybody's got emotions. But this person, who this person is, there's a bunch of people involved in some stuff because Jehovah brought it out, uh, has... has has some type of situation going on, okay? Um, so if there's death issues, there's death issues. If somebody got poisoned, they got poisoned. If somebody's just sick after some, you know, their heart's just broken to pieces on some type of situation, then there's something going on here with this Queen of Cups that keeps coming out. This is you, your wife, your mother, your sister, a co-worker, a, some family member, a cousin, an aunt, what, whoever she is. Uh, she looks really sad in the picture here, okay? So somebody was carrying a dagger and stuff like that. You're dealing with some people that are falling into mischief. They're, 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 they're proud. You always say that somebody was really proud. Listen, a transgressor, uh, the scripture says that a transgre the transgression of the wicked says within their heart that there is no fear of Elohim before his eyes, but 
he, he flatters himself in his own eyes until his iniquity is found to be hateful. And there is somebody hateful around a person, okay? Uh, the words of this person's mouth are just full of deceit. And they like to play. And uh, they're going to be defeated, okay? Um, some, somebody keeps coming around and trying to do something because somebody was really hurt and somebody went out into eternity. And uh, it's time for this person to go away now. Somebody has blasphemy in the Holy Spirit. And um, so the wording in the fixed sign reading, just go watch it. Jehovah stated that, look, your family's involved or your work family and it ain't good. Something's going down. Somebody had fangs about them in the mutable sign reading. Okay. So we had the stingy person, the four pentacles and another deck also showed itself. I think it was in the mutable sign reading. Somebody knows that somebody's greedy for gain. They're trying to secure something. They're profane. Other people know that they got a hold of something that they shouldn't have. And they're just, they're, the the stubbornness is as a sin of witchcraft as well. Somebody is involved in some type of strifeful thing. Okay, so this is strife. Um, strife around money or some type of legal matter would be here with the six of uh, pentacles. Somebody getting scales over their head. There's some type of competition, I guess. Somebody feels like that there is or something like that. Okay, let's just clarify this stuff for you all. It, just because this is here and there's a bunch of people here in the Five of Wands, it's just telling itself, as always, uh, just to confirm that Jehovah's bringing out something is very much emotional around family and co-workers and somebody has played somebody really hard. And they're lofty and... Um, Something is owed to somebody. Uh, there's a lot of money here that, all right, uh, around some situation that's that's went down, and there's contractual things here. Okay, somebody has paid somebody off to go do something, cause some type of strifeful things, because somebody does carry a dagger that, that was showing within that. Then some some people need to really just tap into their intuition and listen to what the great one wants you to do in the next couple of days. Show me this Queen of Cups, Jehovah. What do you want to? If you're in the upright, you're in the upright, obviously. But Jehovah is bringing out something around a bunch of people that is going on. That is not all right. Okay? And it's, it's time for some fool to get out of the way. Yes, there's broken hearts. There's third parties. So somebody carries a dagger, they carry a dagger. Uh, the, the Knight of Cups is I'm um, dreamy type of energy. This card can be a law card. So if somebody does work for the law and they're, they're piercing or something's taking place around some situation from some third party because somebody did get played, then somebody's just somebody sad because somebody did die or somebody had a heart attack or something is here within that. Okay, pregnancy issues um, showing up. And we had the... Um, uh, the temperance card come out and that's the pictograph in the Hebrew of the sperm so somebody did play around it was heartbreaking and somebody took a revenge on that situation and now they're trying to get away with whatever they did because of whatever the crap is going on there's money around all kinds of stuff got a bunch of people involved in some somebody just never never loved and lost a freaking mind and they just they, they went crazy within something show me more information for the cardinal and Jehovah just, he already brought out in the fixed sign and in the mutable sign, there would be maximum protection. If you're standing in the truth, no evil shall befall you. This person's going to go down. It's time for them to fall in their own trap. They did what they did. Um, you know, the love of money is the root of all evil. And somebody's got some type of real, this mind type of energy. No, it's not. So people, other people know somebody's got a whole sentence. It's not theirs. It's not theirs. Not theirs. So we have the... Um, the Empress, so mother figures are here. The Empress is projects. She also represents the law as well. Pregnancy issues then are around somebody. So if this, uh, if this Empress is not in the Empress, she's lost her value, uh, then there's something around it. But we do have legal matters then here around So It's a female boss. It's a female boss. If this is somebody loving, caring, kind, something's happened around this person. She's rich and generous in the Hebrew. Uh, somebody's taken something that, that you know, around 
it's a, a mother energy, then it's here. We got family involved is what was said, okay? So we got bosses. We got something that is going to close out. So the world card is here. Or something happened on a trip. So the uh, the wretch, the head, the man, the boss, the chief, the firstborn of stuff. So we, have, we do have children. And we have secret sexual matters then going on around, I guess, a work situation for some of you all. It's been heartbreaking, okay? Uh, the head is here, and so somebody was beheaded. That energy could be found in one of those readings. So it, it is the meaning of the judgment card in the Hebrew. Um, somebody also was trampled on, but Jehovah's going to trample on somebody. I want to say that the R and the G, the rug uh, type of energy, um, in the phonics, I don't know if it's this this combination in the Hebrew, but that R and the G rug type energy. Somebody was used like a doormat or a rug, or was really trampled on. You're always going to do that to this person. Okay, this is a judgment card. This is something coming right on up that has possibly been hidden for some person, um, and there's some type of an evaluation here. Uh, within a, a work or a family matter or some type of a sexual ordeal that went down that will be judged, okay? There will be some type of a judgment here, okay? There is a war that has been going on. I want to say that the Nine of Wands also showed itself there as well. Somebody walked away from some type of situation, abandoned something that possibly would have been successful, and if some people are dealing with ex issues and then something happened within a matter and they went crazy out of an ordeal and a pregnancy, then I guess... Some, something's here with a situation. Somebody is also on um, big time drugs as well that was involved in a matter. Heavy drugs were, were there. So let's see what's going on. You hope you just pick. Somebody wanted somebody to grow old with, with them, and uh, they're they're really sad when they're apart. We do know, I, I want to say in the mutable sign reading, somebody was, you know, made poor and set aside and all that kind of stuff was coming out as well. There was a card that came out about that. So it's somebody lost their spouse and wanted to grow old with somebody in some type of third party outside situation happened within a, a, a murder or somebody who did carry a dagger and something happened with the person who was un, under drugs, then I guess some type of overindulging stupid energy was there around that, okay? If you do have a love interest and you, this energy is just around you, there's just been something heartbreaking around somebody that, you know, you're sad about being apart from, if it's your mother or your child or whatever's taking place, then somebody's saying that about you. Okay, only you know your situation. Something about a foundation. Okay, I want to say we had an architect um, in one of the other readings. So something happened in some type of a home and you, you hired somebody and something went down within some type of a matter. Then something about a foundation is here. Something pink is here. So the little girl, then that's a little girl situation. Okay. So, again, Jehovah stated that there was somebody really lofty within a matter. And Jehovah's bringing out, I hate a haughty look. Well, so, somebody's getting judged for something, I guess, around a matter. Jehovah, you just bring it out. Something went down. Somebody got killed because they were haughty. Now there's a legal matter around. I guess it is. We also have Yisrael here. Something is really huge going on over there right now. And so we just pray for the peace of Jerusalem and, and the war that's been going on in a very big way. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be ye lifted up, you everlasting doors, so that the King of Glory can come in, yes, and put a judgment on something. We also have Isaiah 60 and 17 coming out here. For brass, I will bring gold, and for iron, I will bring silver, and for wood, brass, and for stone, iron, and I will even make thy officers peace and thine exactors righteousness, okay? So this goes back to Yisrael and the house of Jacob uh, with that there. Somebody's gotten stolen from and Jehovah's going to bring some stuff back. Okay? Everything stolen will be returned. Okay? So we're right on time on prophecy. Okay? So, and we do have officers out here. Something about a phone call or a message is here. Okay? You just need to use your intuition because, they're, you know, if, if the message is about the person who's done the thing that has carried the dagger and then there's a, there's a there will be a judgment. Somebody we already know is guilty on something. If they want to come back around, you hope we'll make sure they're going to fall on their trap. Let them try. Okay, we we do have security and organization. We do have the four pentacles that can go back to that as well. 
feel like I'm supposed to take one of these. Yes, there is a spider energy here. There is also a lizard. We had somebody who had fangs come out in one of the other readings. Okay, well, somebody um, is has been in a perverse thing within a matter. Okay, so because a lizard can go back to that energy. Show me energies, please, for cardinals. So whoever this Queen of Cups is, she showed up. She's, you know, she's the common denominator energy out here. I mean, the Empress has all four queens. But somebody who's real emotional or real dreamy or real something. But, but somebody got things about them. Okay, somebody's got some thievery and uh, around the situation and... A dagger is here. Somebody's heartbroken. And they've been pierced with the knife. But then so this take you back to also the occult, as we know. Again, somebody was also beheaded for some of you all. And that's also prophecy as well. Uh, there is a lot of money here. Well, rich and generous here. And, you know, we got um, ten pentacles here, which is large sums of money. So there's a lot of money. And Yehovah says he's going to bring it back. He's going to give it back what was stolen so there's the cat we actually had the um priest come out and then we had the high priest also there uh which was in the fixed sign reading so something about or the roman catholic church really come out okay i'm just going to read it that way or somebody's likes cats we have two cats showing up here we have a cat here and a cat here the falsity is what this um card represents in this deck somebody has been false around somebody Actually, I do want to say in this deck we did see the thief, or was that a general reading? I want to say it was these, I think it may have been the mutable sign. There was a thief there. Somebody's false around somebody. Okay, somebody was. Uh, and if they're trying to come back around again, here they are coming back around again. Uh, they will be judged. Jehovah will make sure they're, they're judged around the situation. Okay, you deal with somebody who likes to study or something like that. They, um... That other card was just showing us. There's a lot of money around, y'all. A lot. And it will be returned. Jehovah just brought out his his, his, um, his word. This card also came out in one of those other readings. Somebody's given a message. Somebody's giving something back. But again, is somebody trying to come back around and somebody does carry a dagger. And, and because Jehovah stated that family was involved and it's not good. So some people are going to be receiving some information about something that was went down either with your work family your co-workers or your family that was involved in something and it's not good it's heartbreaking and some of you all again if this person is 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 their time is up and they're going to try to come around one less time they're going to fall in their own trap in, in something that's going to take place everything stolen though is going to re be returned to you because Jehovah's word's not going to return void okay this is also generosity here uh, somebody knows about somebody that's foolish. They can't get out of their vomit. They're 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 in folly all the time. They're detached. They know that something was signed and all of that. This is also a clean slate for somebody. Okay, so we have the letter T and the the rat is here. Okay, the R and the T is rat. All right. We also have the G and the L appearing in your reading. Let me take a rune. Remember. We have a lizard out here. We have a spider. We have something about the internet web as well. We also have something at somebody's heel. And somebody's hottie. And Jehovah says, I hate a hottie look. And so he will he will push down that fool every single time. Somebody's wounded, but they're a warrior within a matter. Okay? So there is security and organization around somebody because Jehovah stated that there would be um, maximum protection around the situation. Okay? Jehovah, you just tell us. So this is the Ewas. This goes back to friendship. I want to say that the dog came out in the fixed sign reading in um, in this deck, which would go back to a friend. But somebody thought somebody was a friend. Somebody was false because we had a player there for some people. That won't be for everybody, but for some people. Okay, we have something about loyalty then that is coming out. Marriage and promotion and increase. We got a big time increase type of energy around your energy. Okay, uh, this can look. This is the E, but it can look like an M or a W for person, place, or thing, first, middle, or last name. Uh, 
for the next couple of days. Look, just tap into your intuition and listen to Jehovah. It, only you know what's going on around you, what you've been through. Um, and Jehovah will protect you. Somebody is protected. And some people have already went through this crap. And it's time for this thing to be judged and for somebody to just go away. Okay? Because somebody's false. And that's just that. Until next time. Shalom.